Channels like this, this, and this are going viral with one to two hour long YouTube videos. And these channels are incredibly monetizable and making anywhere between 10 to $20,000 every single month. And the best part is all of these scripts are written with AI getting an average watch time of anywhere between 50 minutes to an hour and 30 minutes. In this video, I'm going to show you how to write these one hour long viral YouTube scripts in just minutes. So when you're writing these one hour plus long YouTube scripts, you have one of two options. Option number one is to use Claude or ChatGPT to write these scripts. But the problem with Claude or ChatGPT is that it doesn't understand YouTube context, meaning it doesn't understand why these one to two hour long videos actually go viral on YouTube. And that's because Claude doesn't have context as to what is a great YouTube script. Plus, if you look at these viral AI storytelling channels, you can see that they have incredibly long watch time because they are optimizing for an audience that is about to fall asleep. So meaning that they're about to fall asleep and then they put these storytelling videos in the background. So these videos get incredible watch time as people fall asleep in the middle of the video. You can see here, a channel like Sleepless's Story has videos with 4 million views, of 2.4 million views, and all of which are two hour long storytelling videos. And I'm gonna show you how to automate writing the scripts for these in just minutes with this AI tool and it's called Subscriber AI. So unlike Claude or ChatGPT, which has a limited context window, meaning that it can only write scripts of maybe up to five 5,000 to 10,000 words. Subscriber AI has a much larger context window, so it's able to write 18,000 word, 20,000 word scripts in a single shot. And I'm gonna show you exactly how to do it, and it writes in your voice too. So if you go to the main page here at Subscriber AI, you can start your free trial or you can log in. And once you press log in, you'll be brought to this dashboard. So the first thing that you have to do is that you have to add your channel. So let's say I'm running the channel Sleepless Historian over here, which got 4 million plus views on these two hour long videos. What I can do is I can just add my channel over here, Sleepless Historian, and immediately it generates an audience avatar for me. And it also generates the voice of my channel. So meaning that it scrapes the top 10 to 20 videos on this channel, understands the voice so that it is able to write like it. And just like that, we can immediately get to writing the script. Or if you want to create a variation of Sleepless Historian, what you can do is you can go to add channel. So you can go here to remix your channel. You can tell it, I want to remix Sleepless Historian. You want to give it the sleep less medieval, right? And you can tell subscriber how you will make it different in terms of, oh, I want it to be more attuned to medieval times. And then it will adapt the voice and it will adapt the audience based on this specific new customer avatar that you're looking at. So you can see over here in literally less than 10 seconds, we have generated a new audience avatar medieval history enthusiast. You can see the demographics, the psychographics, the online behavior, the offline behavior, and the key questions over here. So that it will help write the script. So right now, the AI immediately with just a click of a button understands your specific audience avatar and your voice. So it knows exactly how to write in your style. So the next step will be to open up the new chat and then ask it for specific video ideas. So you just want to select your channel over here and then you can ask it to come up with video ideas. You can tell the AI to come up with video ideas. And the best part about subscriber AI is that it's trained on 40,000 plus viral YouTube videos. So it understands what viral formats are and it's able to adapt it to come up with viral video ideas. So I can just ask it something simple like, look at my top 10 videos that are performing in the past year. Give me a recommendation for a video idea. And instantly it will you know, be able to scrape my actual channel, Sleepless Historian, and then give me a specific winning video idea. And just like that, you can see over here, it gives me my best performing videos within the past year. It gives me my specific outlier score of those videos. And then it gives recommendation, video idea recommendation, medical horror, and it gives you your title and packaging. You see over here, medieval cures that will kill you today. Actually, I think that's pretty good. What happened when you got sick in medieval times? Let's say medieval cures that would kill you today. That seems like a pretty interesting topic. Plus you can do all of these, right? You have AI, so you can literally write it in minutes. So it's not that big of a deal in terms of which idea you pick because you're mostly going for a volume pay here, play here. And then you can ask it to explore the video idea of which I'll tell you, okay, right? It gives you a full outline of exactly what you're gonna be talking about. And then you can t ask it, hey, just to confirm, do you want the script to be titled, right? At a length of 1600 words. It's like, no, I am trying to write a two hour long script, just like my other videos. I like the title. So it's literally conversational. You can just answer any questions that it has. And literally it will start producing the full script over here. And yes, just to confirm, you want to create a script title this at 20,000 words. 
They also issue 13 credits, should I create a script now? Yes, create the script. And bang, it immediately opens a canvas here on the side where it asks you a bunch of questions, right, that you can answer. And here you can add any research or any context that you have, or you can ask it to do AI research, more of that in a little bit. But over here, the first thing that you wanna do is you wanna select the template, right? Okay, let's say it's a documentary template, language in English, we can see the script length here, we can adjust it. Over here, it can go up to 30,000 words. Let's say we want to do it at 30,000 words. And in terms of the AI model, let's say I want to use Claude for Sonnet and I have the documentary template. And just like that, I can answer any question that it has here. And the more in depth that I answer these questions, the better it will be able to spit out a script like this. So it asks, do you want a gentle sleep friendly delivery of bit more gore, right? I can just copy paste this. Yes, I want a gentle sleep minimal gore. Yep, which 12 cures, right? I don't really know what the 12 cures are. How do you want to balance narrative vignettes? Da, 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 da. What parents also historians should we quote um, to add calm authority, right? I don't really know the answer to these. So honestly, I can leave it blank. Or what I can do here is I can go and add context and I can add AI research onto here. So whereas normally you would have to go to ChatGPT or to Claude or to Perplexity in order to do this research or search up articles, you can click here AI research and we have Perplexity built into this tool. So that will give us this necessary context in order to write this script super duper efficiently, which I absolutely love. So I can just say, I wanna add these articles over here and then I, it will just immediately start researching these articles performing deep research like it would with a tool like perplexity.ai, which is the leading tool in terms of research, which we have built into here. And it will use that as context to help write the YouTube script. And you can see here, I'm not doing anything super complex. I'm not feeding it any complex. I'm just pressing a couple buttons over here. And you can see over here, we can add up to 75,000 words of context, which means you can literally upload an entire book and you still won't be able to fill this context. But the beauty of this tool is that you don't even need to feed it that much context because it's it's trained on the stories of your past videos. So if you have any personal stories that you want to add that you've mentioned in other videos, it will actually be able to scrape that and write the script based on that. So let's say I'm fully happy with this answer. I can just click here, generate outline, and then it will start generating the outline immediately. Perfect. And you can see over here in less than a minute, we have the outline. So you can modify this outline so that you have an idea of how this whole script will flow. But generally the outline is pretty good. You can see over your hundred words, it tells you how many words each section is. Some 50 words, 650 words, right? And it does all of this own research on its own because a subscriber is just that smart and it's trained on a bunch of videos that you had previously over here. And it's able to take information from that. And you can see over here, 700 words, and it just goes on and on and on and on and on. Okay, uh, I wanna make sure that this script is actually 30,000 words, right? Uh, can you confirm if this script will be 30,000 words based on this outline? So, okay, it tells me here, right? Oh, average between anywhere 20,000 to 30,000 words. I want it to be at 30,000 words. And then, okay, it's telling me that it's gonna be closer to 30,000 words. So let's see the accuracy in terms of the length here. So I just kind of read through this outline, right? I changed a couple of things, but in general, it looks pretty good. So we just click script here and then it will just click generate script and then it will start generating the full script. Let's see how long that this takes. And bang, you can see over here, 7,600 scripts and the words are just like slowly, slowly ticking up as it is fully writing the script. And you can see over here, the script is just like slowly forming itself. And we can even read the intro. You wake up with a scratchy throat, nothing serious, just that familiar tickle that says you're getting sick. So you reach for some Tylenol, maybe goggle some salt water and figure you feel better in a day or two. Now imagine that same scratchy throat, but it's 1347. You live in a world where the innocent little tickle becomes a 10 day nightmare of medieval medical intervention. Your local physician, a man who genuinely believes your fever comes from angry moon demons, approaches you with his toolkit, a dirty knife, a handful of squirming leeches, and an absolute confidence that he knows exactly how to help you. Spoiler alert, he doesn't. Tonight, we're taking a gentle journey through the world of medieval medicine, where good intentions met catastrophically bad science which I think is a pretty good intro uh, considering we didn't even give it any context. And it's something that will pass in terms of a storytelling video of these long form storytelling videos. So now let's wait for it to fully generate. We're here at 9,000 words as of now. So I'll come back to you when this is fully generated. 
And bang, you can see over there, we have 27,000 words, uh, which is about 169 minutes, which is over two hours, almost at the three hour length, all with just the press of one button. This took about, you know, five minutes to generate. And you can see over here, this script just goes on and on and on and on and on and on and on forever. And this is actually 27 thousand words long just with the press of a button you can see over here i didn't change the context right the script chat looks the exact same and this is just all with the press of one button and if you still don't believe me control control c if you put this into a word counter it's twenty seven thousand words word counter.net so i think this is pretty pretty impressive and once again you can do this with any script right you can write up to three hour scripts with just the press of one button which i think is pretty amazing uh for any AI tool. So if you want to run these AI storytelling channels, I highly recommend that you check out this tool, subscriber.ai. Now, also, if you want to see how subscriber AI can clone any YouTube channel, click over here and I'll show you exactly how you can clone your favorite YouTube channel and use it for yourself.